it's the thrill of success and the thrill of winning. That's what really keeps me going and, and really drives me. I knew I loved driving a race car when I was very young. I mean, you know, five years old is when I first got behind the wheel of a, of a race car that my, my stepfather had brought home. I was gung-ho on just about anything, especially if it had wheels and, and went real fast. Success came quickly for Jeff Gordon. He had won over 600 races and eight national titles by the age of 22. Then he burst onto the NASCAR circuit in 1993, winning 30 races before turning 26 and becoming the youngest ever to win the Daytona 500. With two series titles in three years, Gordon is still on the fast track to success. That's, to me, what's really important, is to be able to go to a lot of different types of racetracks uh, and, and conquer or, or, you know, to really accomplish things at different styles and different size tracks, uh, because then you're universal, and that's, that's something that, that wins championships. Conquering is what Jeff Gordon does best. But in the midst of all the victories, demands, and expectations, he has managed to keep a sense of perspective. You know, racing is important to me. Uh, it's an important part of my career. But uh, I really don't know what I would do without, uh, without the Lord in my life right now. It, it really has made a big difference, not only on the racetrack, but off the racetrack. I mean, it's a dangerous sport that we're in out there. And it's not really whether you win or lose on the racetrack. It's whether you win or lose with the Lord. And, and I've come to realize that, hey, there's a far greater place. There's, there's so many bigger goals for me to set out there than just whether or not I win this race or win that race or win a championship.